Titans, winners by six goals to nil at the top of their form after the game against underdogs last week. MSC, who were held 2-2 by the resurgent Chido, put a dent in their title aspirations. They're two points behind Titans coming into this game. MSC starting off with Amar back in net, Akil, Akib, Jibril, Khalid, Ali, Jaffa, and Ozzy. Unchanged outfield lineup, Arif. Just the goalkeepers that changed. Amar in for Tango, who's on holiday. They've got Keith and Haroon on the bench. MSC starting off with Atik in net, changed from Dean last week. I think Dean may be on uh, other duties today with Abdi Nasir and Damo playing a centre back. Josh who just freezes the ball. Imi Rizzi playing attacking mid. Tay the striker and a shot by Josh early on. And Mansu playing and left. Mr. Khan, uh, can you just shed some light on why you left the captain's group? What do you mean? <laughs> captain's group. I'm not the captain. <laughs> <laughs> well, he did re re remove quite a few people from the MSC group. And then Mansour has had to come off because his boots aren't of the right standard. He's changing into his black boots now, Astros. They're very nice, by the way. Ali. He's giving it away. Tay with a chance. Early chance, early doors. What an opportunity, Ali Arif, for Tay to put uh, MFC in front against the league leaders, the two-time champions, Titans, who are going for their third title in four seasons. Then Dean's come in and Dean's conceded a few goals. I think he was at fault for the, for the second goal last week. And uh, we've got the third keeper now, Atik. They're finding a real problem. And to win the league, you need to have a stable defence and a stable uh, goalkeeper playing. And uh, they're going to struggle unless they find that right formula, I think, Arif. And here's Josh. Easy for Amar. I mean, if it was... Well, I beg pardon, it's 1-1. A BTK scored earlier on and underdogs have equalised. Wow. Khalid, good work. A burst of acceleration into the feet of Jaffa Khalid. Both teams have now come very close. Yeah, they put a, Abdi Nasser. Yeah, they put a box around him. You see Abdi Nasser, Rizzi, and Demo, and uh, Mansoor form a box around Jaffa and not giving him any chance to feed off some support. Here's Akib, who's been venturous going forward. Atik low down at the near post. Assertive goalkeeping from Atik. Uh, quite a few of his own players as well. Demo. Imiak. Mansoor's in the middle. Has it come off Akil's arm? He's saying no. He's, and uh, Imi's, Imi's uh, adamant that it come off his hand. Uh, I think Arif had his hands close to his body, so I think you're never going to really win that. If his hands are out by his sides, then you're going to get it. Although in the rules now, Arif, in the FA rules, if it touches your hand in any way whatsoever, it should be a penalty. <laughs> Abdi Nasir. Imiak. Oh, Trying to take away from Ozzy and put it into the middle. Amar kicks it out. Daniel. Ali, Rizzi Jaffer one on one against Abdi Nasser. Jaffer has got the strength, he's got the shot, and he's saved by Atik. Last week, Akib. Now Ozzy, chance for Ozzy. Goal for Titans. Ozzy's seventh goal of the season. Oh, what a crucial goal it could be in the context of the title race. It's a fantastic goal right on the brink of half time. Ozzy with some quality footwork. Akib again making those runs down the left hand side. And uh, this time he's assisted Ozzy, whose footwork was absolutely brilliant, spot on, and his finishing was on point. Ozzy, seventh of the season, as I said, and it's MFC nil, Titans one. Imi Hak, can he bring the back level? Right across the corridor of uncertainty again. And no one was in the middle. What a chance for MFC to. Pegged them back immediately. That's where you wanted Big Tay to be. The attacking midfielders, Mansoor, I was wondering. Akib. Look at her. Set Jaff up now. Went to his knee. Still Jaffa. Jabril being pulled back. Ozzy around the key tick. 2 0. Oh my goodness. Ozzy has done it again, just like he did against Underdogs last week. He's gone round the goalkeeper. Eighth of the season now for Ozzy. MFC are rattled at the moment. Titans are putting MFC to the sword here. And it's a corner kick now. It's a corner kick for Titans. Jibril. Corner near post. Ozzy going in for his hat trick. That's the half time whistle. And Titans winning 
By two goals to nil, they have rattled underdogs. Aussie with two fantastic close finishes. And we said fine margins. And there's the fine margins that's making the difference here. It don't matter about playing about that. Can we change it and win it? Yeah. Two Come four. on. Two pockets are clean. Well, yeah, to be honest, play, you're playing fine. Two you're doing well. Bit, create, no, create a bit more. There. The, how they're playing? How they're playing? Yeah, what I was saying, exactly the same. It's very deep. You're going to try and pump it long. You know that's how they're going to play. So you're doing a great job, generally getting back. But we don't have anything then higher up the pitch uh, when we're breaking. That was an amazing pass. No one in the middle. Please take this mic. We have to get the oh, team okay. talks in. Nice no, time. all it is is we've got a half. We can have a moan like we yeah, normally yeah. do, or we can start we'll again, nil-nil, and go for it. You've done something fine. wrong. We can't. I know, but it's done now. It's done now, isn't it? Can we go and win it? One half, we can win. Everyone put the graph. Playing good though, man. Just two chances. That's all it is. Keep ball, man. When we just keep the ball, we keep the ball perfectly. That guy's nullified, and he's their best player. He's nullified. You get me? Yeah. No, that guy. No, no, Keep they, him off the ball. What, what they're doing is because these two are doing yeah, well, well against the two, and they've got yeah. the third and the next guy, yeah, Akeem, Akeem, Akeem and uh, Aussie, Aussie are free, free on that side. Job, so right? you have to just watch. Just watch. No, no, it's not. It's not marking them. It's just watch the run through. Like Akeem, he's he's got us squared up a couple of times in that corner, yeah, he's and he's just done a through. cut back. Stop you going through, man. He's gonna be. If that's what he does. That's what he does. They're gonna stop you if Emi beats them out there. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Hit him. Hit him. Masoud, hit him. Don't go soft. If he beats you, hit him. Listen, right, cool, let's go again. You're using T at the top. You're staying as you are. The tactic is if you use him, get the wonderful. MSC positive in that team talk, despite cutting those two late goals. Here's Akib coming forward. I wonder what the Titans team talk would have been like. Akib. And Jabril's coming in at the far post. Yusuf Khan had to make that interception. And the corner comes in from Ozzy at the far post. Akib is there, trying to return the favour, Ozzy, to Akib for setting up his uh, first goal. And here's Akib lifting it in. Jaffa is the target, it's gone too far over. Imi's just waiting. Normally he's very good at running, and here he is now. Abdi Nasir. And there, so he's gone in! What a clumsy goal! It's Demo! He played through the crowd. MFC because he did a similar goal like that against Old Guard. And it's it's 2-1. And uh, MFC had a pass ball back into this game. And then Naz, who was making fun of me about Jim, can't even cl climb it. Bro. And the ball goes out. Ali. Looking for Tay. Tay using his strength against Khalid. Oof, and uh, Imi and uh, Tay tried to get through. Ali was in the way, and it's uh, kicked away by a keep, and is uh, going to get booked. Uh, MFC are really resorted to tactics to try and get their opposition players booked here, particularly from the side. They're peeling everything and everything. Well, 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 he did kick the ball away, but I don't. It's, well, no time being wasted here, is there, Arif? Josh is relative, and here's Tay. Oh, it's come off Mansoor on the line. And uh, MFC are turning the screw. Titans are a little bit rattled now. Demo, Ali was on the ground. Imiak, can he unleash a shot? Here he does. Are we going to see Keith coming on? Are we going to see Haroon coming on? Uh, I think, uh, Arif, do you think it's time that Keith came on to steady the, steady the ship at the moment because uh, they're, they're, wo they're, they're wobbling? They need a, a man who's good at, you know, emergencies. Uh, <laughs> they need to dial 999 and call uh, Keith in. Okay, dial 999. We need a fire emergency from Titans. So they pick him out. And here's Josh backing up. Imiak. And his left foot now. Imiak trying to curl it in. I think he came off uh, a Kiel's fly. And he's asking for anything. Imi's smiling. He's got into the Titans' heads. Imiak puts in the middle. Akib, Ozzy. Outside of the boot, trying. Ozzy again. Now Jaffa, chance for Jaffa. Josh hits it. It's come off Akib. T, still T. Mansoor, and T's picked the ball up. It's a free kick. Imiak for MFC. Nine goals this season. Will he become the first player? This season to hit double figures. Imi Hak. It's the post. It's cracked. It's the post. Armitage fell silent as he hit it. 
and then the silence was broken by the post being rattled, MFC are getting closer and closer and closer. For MFC to get themselves an equaliser, possibly a winner to keep their title chances alive. Abdi Nasser heads it out. Imiak getting it down. Now through the legs of Ozzy. Khalid against Imi's body. They've got to save this one. It's going to be a corner right as he keeps it in play. Thrown out, thrown out towards Mansoor. There's two on this left-hand side. Mansoor leaves the ball behind him. Yusuf's ahead of him. It's still Mansoor. He's tried an ambitious effort towards goal, trying to catch Amar out. And Haroon wants to go freaky with a push in the back. He's not going to get it. And then Imiak. Imiak scored a chance. It's a foul. And then the man behind the goal is trying to tell Imi where to put it. He's making a nuisance of himself. Is that where Imi's going to put it? He's ah. aiming for there. He's asking for handballs. No, he's the whist Haroon, indication. Haroon. Jaffa to kill the game off. Jaffa still. Holding off Damois from former underdog's teammate. He does. And here comes Mansoor again now for MFC. Charging forward. Imiak. He's not been short of chances in this game, Imiak. Not too many clear cut ones. But nonetheless, he's created chances for himself. He's creating another one for himself. Imiak steps past. Akil. He's given a goal kick. Has he given a penalty? He's given a penalty! Can you believe it? Okay. He's given a free kick. It was it was as clear as they are if that, that was a dive by Imiak. He went and just fell over. Haroon is he can't believe it. He's been in Senori's face. And there's uh there's the MFC fan. He's behind the net again, he's on the other side. He wants him to put it there. It's Josh who's going to take it this time. Look, there he is. He's just there. He's saying, put it here. He's waving his arms. Is Josh going to listen? Is that Haroon's hand? Cleared away. Went to single digits in terms of the time left. Josh. Imihak. Keith is there. Here comes Haroon. All alone, Haroon. It's a corner. Jaffa. Is that handball by Demo? Is that handball by Demo? It is. Penalty. Ozzy generally goes to the goalkeeper's right, Arif. Generally, yeah, he does. Is he going to do it this time? And, Ozzy, and Atik will. No, he does! He beats Atik! Bottom of the onion bag. You can't save those side of the net. MFC have been beaten here tonight. Ozzy 3, MFC 1. And a standing ovation for the hat trick here, who's on nine goals now this season, Ozzy Eunice. Abdi Nasser, not enough space for him. And here comes Ali. Josh is the last man. Haroon wants it. Here is Haroon. Can he score a fourth for Titans? Atik saves his. So that's his body. Imiak, bring it now. Imiak carried it all the way. Rizzi Malik. And Yusuf's in the middle. And again, that's the second time the ball's been played across the corridor of uncertainty by MSC this game. And they've not had another man on the end of it. Demo. Keeps it in play, Demo. Puts it in there for Mansoor. Is that a slide? I wouldn't have counted, I think, with the slide. You know, cutthroat. Today they've been uh, soaking up the pressure and uh, they've come out on top. Haroon! And they almost deflected by Keith. Um, do you think uh, they'll go on to win it now? Yeah, I think they will. I, th I don't think many teams will be. I think that game against BTK was a one off, but I think they're going to win the league now. Who do you think the nearest challenges will be now that MFC are pretty much out of the title race? I think MFC will still finish second because I think they've played really well, you know, generally. But I, I can't see any of the teams coming second now. Yeah. And uh, Demo's in there. Rizzi Malik. What about Cosmos? Do they not impress you? Yeah, they do. But they don't have many ch winners, you know, like championship winners. So I don't know. I mean, they, they seem like they just play for fun. All right. Thank you. you guys. Oh, okay. What do you think? I think Cosmos will give them a good run for the money, but tonight's game against Finest is massive for uh, Cosmos. If they because if they beat Finest, then they can mi mi limit it to themselves and Titans uh, and the level on points with them. Then, and I think the game against Titans, I think second to third to last week, will be the massive one. Imi, now Mansoor. Mansoor. Cracks the woodwork. Second time this game they've hit the woodwork. Nasser. Rizzi Malik. Lifting it towards Mansoor and headed out by Akil. 
cleared away. His eyes, his loose touches, and it's Jabril. And we see a shot at the back now. Jabril shifts it for Ali, and that toe was vital. Rizzi gets there. Ali's there though, and here is Keith. Keith through the legs of Rizzi. Keith Clarkson, and Ali goes to ground. Haru knows the ground. And the final whistle has gone. Titan the one by three goes to one. Akeem played a vital role. That's a vital victory, Arif, for Titans by three goals to one against MFC. They're on 19 points now. Six, uh, seven wins, one draw and one defeat. And uh, it, it was their seven wins, one draw and one defeat, sorry for him. It was the three points deducted that have hit them from BTK, but they've bounced back from that with nine goals and one goal conceded in their two games. Fantastic win for you uh, against a very tough tie. Um, you won 6-0 last week. What was different tonight? We're playing a better team. They, they weren't fucking. Uh, this was going to be the hard, I knew this was going to be the hardest game I think we played all season, and it was. The scoreline tells us that. You know the two. They know the one we lost and all that, but this, they're fucking. They're, they're a tough, tough team. You see that to the end. We were all had to be 100%. Otherwise, we weren't going to win that. Otherwise, no good way. I was watching on the side, and a number of times you went down the left-hand side, and then eventually you created a goal for Ozzy. Was part of that part of your game plan? Well, we knew they were going to try and play through Imi, so I thought if we win it back, we will win it back on his side. You know, he likes to cheat sometimes, so if we're going to get any joy, it's going to be down that side because of that. They're not a team full of grafters, just some grafters. That's the difference. Our team is full Yo, of chill, grafters. Man. That's it. Ozzy, um, you scored a goal at the start. Um, we were talking about it might be fine margins, but how fine was that goal for you? It was literally like an inch away from Rizzy tackling as I just quickly turned and shot and scored. I knew that cheap's not going to save it. You've seen him do it six or seven times in the last three weeks. That's Ozzy's goal, the rollover poke. You've seen him do it plenty of times. That's it. Ozzy, your second goal was carbon copy of what you scored against underdogs last week. Is that something you already think about in your mind if the goalkeeper comes out? Yeah, because they're going to slide out every time. So all I think is quickly turn and shoot and it works every time. And then you got the penalty and immediately you took the ball. Are you normally the penalty taker or did you just get it for a hat-trick? No, I've got it for a hat trick. I'm, I don't take penalties. I thought I might as well get two hat tricks in two weeks, on it? You've got nine goals now. Is a golden boot your target, or you just yeah, you're on nine goals. You, golden, you, that's that's the modesty of the man. Are you aiming the, for the golden boot, or are you just playing for the team now? Playing for the team. Every goal we score is a team goal. We don't know individuals in our team. Akib, do you think you can go on winning the title now? You bounce back from those three points deducted. Take more off us, man. We're just going to steamroll teams. That's it. This was the team where this was the this banana was skin. This was the banana skin. You know, they, they talk a lot. MFC. They talk all the time. A fair play to them. They're a good side. They talk all the time. But I knew this was going to happen tonight. Yeah. I knew this was going to happen. And have you got any words for Imi? <laughs> don't worry, man. Just don't blame the ref for that. Just don't blame the ref for this game. It's three-one. No Their goal. Imi, that goal was. <laughs> if, if Imi doesn't play for these, they're, they're non-existent. So our game plan was keep yeah. Imi and Monso out the game and we did that and it worked. Apart from that, they didn't really do much, did they? Fantastic. You're right, guys, it was really close for Man of the Match. I'm going to have to give it to Ozzy, but I keep that was a fantastic game by you. Ozzy, shake down Man of the Match.